Hi Water Sign, welcome to my channel. We're doing your December 8th Friday Daily Love Soulmate Relationship. This is gonna be for the Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Um, here we're gonna see your situation and how it pans out in our extended and how they feel towards you. So let's begin. There are things flashing over there. Do help yourself. Okay, those are the links to our extended reading. Links to our 2018 reading. Let's see now here. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Friday, let's see what you're dealing with. Ace of Pentacles, an offering. This is the drop but for me for a relationship because when it's tangible, and this is the minor arcana for me for a sun card because it's just a big opportunity. Take it, it's yours. You water it, put some emotion, put some love in it, it grows, okay? That's how we work with the earth energy. Put a little bit of water in there, it grows. Very positive also, this is a new chance. Some people can be meeting a new earth sign also. Virgo Taurus Capricorn. You could be connecting with a younger fire sign also this Friday. Okay? This is when chemistry is there. One has something to offer about their stability. This person can be set, meaning you know they have good finances also. And the other person is more the adventurous type. Page of Wands, of course, this person is all about excitement, having fun, lighthearted. You know, this can be a Sagittarian energy. They they're about out and about. Okay, that's what I'm sensing here. Asking you out. Oh wow, interesting. Everybody's getting the tower, but on a different vibration though, because the the fire sign got this. Because how many times I got this and it's like a surprise. It's not like it's crumbling down. Because we just came from a Scorpio time and this is Mars energy. And everything that was, you know, that was shaken up now, something new is coming. This is a surprise. Trust me, this is a surprise. I'll, 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 I'll get it. Ooh. It's not just a surprise. This is sex. This is a devil card. And this is sexual also. Okay. So someone here is very much connected with a person. Earth energy also. For a water sign, you're connecting here. <laughs> Sorry, I need to silent my phone. Okay, you're connecting here with someone who sees you as, um, who's very bounded by you. You see this, um, you know, it's like you were separated before, and yet this person came back. That's how I'm seeing this, and you guys have amazing intimate connection. There was a separation over here. So. For some, it was a separation, only to find out that you guys are still karmically connected. The contract is not done. Underneath the tower, yeah, this is my last minute walking away card because that person is still holding a cup, right? So this person is waiting, okay? One more chance, this person came back. So they offered, got rejected, can be, and then they came back with the Eight of Cups. You know, they, they still offered one more time. Oh, wow. And the other person overcome this, the Devil card. The Devil card can be an obsession. The devil card can be feeling attached, anything excess, anything extra, addiction, right? We all heard. But they have overcome it. If this person was all about sex, now it's all about compassion. This is love, Leo energy. And this is possession, Capricorn energy. And it's almost like the person came back because of that. They walked away and then they came back with, with you know, facing love instead of just being material, instead of just being earthy. And that's what shocked you. It shocked you that this person changed from the devil card to being um, strength card. That's a big change right there. They conquered the beast. The beast is a devil card over there. Two of swords. Yep. They were in the deciding moment. Someone was in the deciding moment. And then the other person went within. This is when they, um, you know, they already fought their own battle. And then now this is also someone who's researching, Googling, trying to figure out the connection. High priestess, they're not talking. Someone who is not talking while the other person is trying to figure out what to do. So the other person has the control of the situation right now. Because there was there was a change with the other person. And then for the other when they change now, this person who pleaded, like before I walk away, this is what, you know, this is it. I'm gonna walk away. You know, now they're thinking, they're rethinking the situation. Okay. And they're gonna come back and make an offer. The one who originally had Ace of Pentacles, they're coming back. So if you were the one who was supposed to walk away or who walked away and then you made a decision, offer is going to be made to you, okay? I mean, if you were the one who, who changed, offer is going to be made to you, water sign. It starts again with this person 
giving you the opportunity because it's a page of Pentacles. Learning also, this person has learned with a surprise the tower, okay? And then they make the choice. All right. So, water sign. I'm going to continue this reading on how it pans out after this offer. At the same time, their feelings towards you. Thank you very much, guys, for watching. There are links down there. Do help yourself, and I'll see you guys again. Bye.